Yes! 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 <gasps> the Philadelphia 76ers are going to re-sign J.J. Redick on a one-year deal ranging from 12 to 13 mil. That's huge. I mean, that's him taking a pay cut, understanding the situation that's at hand here for the Sixers. And that was a concern for me. It was a concern that it didn't happen yet. I am thrilled. This is perfect. Let's go. Let's move forward. I mean, there's not much to it other than... You, that was huge for us to re-sign him. We thought he was going to come back here and take a little bit of a pay cut. He discussed in the media conversation last year after the season ended. Listen, this was where I, I enjoyed basketball the most. Not that they, he didn't love everywhere else he played, like L.A., but he had the freedom with Brett Brown to go out there and play the way that he wanted to play basketball. So I, I was kind of, you know, seeing this coming – but then the delay a little bit got me a little nervous. I'm thinking, oh, no, is he waiting to see if we make moves? But at the end of the day, we get the job done. He takes the pay cut. We're talking 12 to 13 mil. I mean, that's insane compared to what he was getting paid last year. He understands the team situation. He understands what we're trying to attack. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, basketball gods. That's one step done. One step out of the way. We have a lot to do moving forward, but this is a sigh of relief because if we didn't keep JJ, what were we going to do? What were we going to do? So uh, listen, it, it, it seems minor and it is kind of minor compared to something like Kawhi Leonard, something like LeBron trying to attack those guys. It is minor, but at the end of the day, think about it. If we didn't re-sign JJ, what was going to happen with the, this squad? What, where, where would we have gone? So it's, it's big in that sense. It's big. Now we, we crossed that off the list. That's one thing we needed to do this offseason. Now let's move forward. I am, I am thrilled, though. I am very thrilled to see him take a pay cut like that, to want to come back. That shows me he wants to be here. He believes in this system. He believes in this. And maybe that, that goes to other players, other players around the league that are thinking Philadelphia, maybe. Maybe that shows Kawhi Leonard. People want to be here. That says a lot about the culture being built in this locker room with Brett Brown, with this front office situation. It says a lot. So, you know, it seems minor, but at the same time, it, it, it's a pretty big thing, right? The pay cut's huge. Can't go unnoticed. Let's see it, man. Let's see it. it. It helps this team tremendously. We got J.J. Redick back, baby. I love him. He's a great player. Great player. Can shoot the ball. He's an he's a awesome person. A great veteran leadership kind of player to be around these young guns. And I love it. I love it. It means a lot. So... There it is. There's one thing checked off the list. I hope I have uh, more to come here. Let's go, Sixers. Keep it coming. Hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe. Comment down below. I'll see you next time.